Here are 10 monologues from brand new plays for male actors. These speeches will be perfect for auditions, assessments and showcases. So let's go. The Comedian from Feeling Afraid as if something terrible is going to happen by Marcelo Dos Santos. Start on page 13 at the line, now it could be that he's American, the American, and stop on page 15 at yes, a thousand times yes. This one person play is about a stand-up comedian who's looking for his Mr. Right. Here he's on his second date with an American guy and they're checking out pretty boys in paintings at the National Portrait Gallery. It's a funny and cheeky speech. Michael from Cruise by Jack Holden. Start on page 15 at the line, the year is 1980, and stop on page 17 at, in a tragic comedy with a running time of eight years. This is another brilliant one person play. It's the story of Michael, an 18 year old man, spending what he thinks is his last night on earth in Soho in 1980. It's a really active speech full of energy and imagery as he arrives in Soho for the first time and is absorbing the all consuming sights and sounds. Lucas from our generation by Alecky Blythe. This fuses two mini monologues together. The first bit is on page 69 in a scene called 1, 2, 14, Mum Don't Be Angry. The second bit is on page 97 in a scene called 2, 3, 1, 2, Jeff Bezos. Lucas is a young student speaking about exams and work experience. He's posh, polite and jolly. Cut out the couple of interjections by Kemi in the second section to make the monologue work. Jack from Scandal Town by Mike Bartlett. Start on page 52 at My Pleasure Shall Not Be Contained and stop at the bottom of the page at What's in the Dark Nature of Our Desire. Jack is a lovable rogue who's drunk and riotously shouting at a crowd of people at the Netflix Masked Ball in London. This play is a contemporary restoration comedy and although it's a short speech, lots of fun can be had exploring the drunkenness of Jack. Cut out Phoebe's two tiny interjections to make the monologue work. Darren from Bacon by Sophie Swithenbank. Start at the top of page 10 at So and stop on page 11 at People Know Me Round Here In It. Darren has been suspended from school and is hanging around Brentford. Here he's retelling his unique technique of walking through the McDonald's drive through to get his nuggets. It's a very leery and laddish speech. Ed from Big Big Sky by Tom Wells. Start on page 17 at applied for for a job here, turn warden and stop on page 19 at hopefully anyway. Ed is 21 and he's looking for a job in bird conservation. Here he's speaking to Lauren about his passion for birds and building fences. It's a very simple and sweet monologue. Cut out the small interjections in the second half of this section to make the monologue work. Hasib from I Wanna Be Yours by Zia Ahmed. Start on page 59 at Toby's two and a half and stop on page 60 at Toby, we gotta leave. Hasib is a spoken word artist from London. He's childminding Toby in a park and he's being unnecessarily challenged on why he's there by an older woman. It's a great little speech with a very funny ending. Him from Love and Other Acts of Violence by Cordelia Lynn. Start at the bottom of page 14 at Hi and stop on page 17 at I'm definitely coming down now. Him fancies her. He is high on drugs and has come to her's front door at 5 a.m. It's a very funny, awkward, and clumsy speech. Cut out all of her's small interjections and the monologue will work perfectly. Ivor from Wife by Samuel Adamson. Start on page 57 at No, I'm not falling for that class war bullshit and stop on page 58 at The people who matter won't care. Ivor is 28, he's in a pub in 1988 with his boyfriend Eric. Ivor is angry at Eric for not being honest about his sexuality. He's denouncing both the establishment and the prejudiced people around him with passion, clarity and conviction. Cut out Eric's two tiny interjections to make the speech work. Calentini from Yellowfin by Marek Horn. Start on page 49 at The Black Market Stuff and stop on page 52 at So Much Waste for So Few Answers. This play is set in the near future where all fish have disappeared. Calentini is a young man who's being questioned by three US senators about trading rare marine commodities. It sounds unusual, but it's a fiercely fascinating speech and an incredibly relevant and thought provoking play. Yellowfin is set in Washington DC, so an American accent will work well for Calentini. Cut out the four small interjections on page 51 to make the monologue work. So there we go, 10 monologues from brand new plays for male performers. These plays are available to read on Drama Online. You can subscribe to Drama Online and get access to hundreds of plays digitally. Or you can order the playtext directly from the publishers, Bloomsbury, Nick Hearn Books and Faber and Faber. 
or you can order them from Amazon. And if you're in London, you can visit the National Theatre Bookshop, the Royal Court Bookshop, Foils on Charing Cross Road, or the Calder Bookshop, which is opposite the Young Vic. These bookshops all have huge selections of play texts for sale. Thanks ever so much for watching to the end. If this video's helped you, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel too. And finally, check out these other videos that I've put up that I think you'll like. Take care and all the best. Thank you.